Hey guys, just another quick one. This uh, guy I've been working on for my command squad. Just an apothecary. Thought I'd put him in a running pose. I figure him being an apothecary, he's uh, he's going to be needed all over the battlefield, and just made more sense, you know, to see him, you know, running or charging out to the aid of his fellow Marines. So, I actually kind of had a, <clears throat> excuse me, kind of had a hard time with this one. I I took out my figures for the command squad, and I I got. You know, my two cans of primer, the Skull White and Chaos Black, and merrily priming along, and I had intended to prime this one white, and uh, without paying attention, I just went ahead and primed it black, and then uh, as I'm waiting on the figures to dry, shaking up the Skull White, I'm thinking, ah, crap, I already primed that, so rather than try to prime it again and risk losing a lot of detail and you know, coming out with a really crappy deal. <clears throat> I decided to just go ahead and, and uh, try to paint white on black, which I'm sure any of you guys have tried that. It's not the easiest thing to do. I don't know. Some of you guys might find it really easy. If you do, uh, please let me know, you know what kind of techniques you have that, that make it real easy. <clears throat> anyway, sorry guys. Clear my throat there. So anyway, uh, there it is. Nothing special kind of the same routine with the metals that you guys have probably heard me say before just starting out with uh, bolt metal in black and then working my way up to mithril silver so try to kind of add a wear and tear look to everything so anyway let me know what you think guys and uh, thanks for watching I appreciate everybody who's subscribed um, I'll try to keep some uh, new content coming Try to keep some interesting things out there. And uh, I appreciate you guys. Thanks.